morning. Now look at my hair. It's okay. I'm washing it tonight because I can't no more. I can't take it anymore. But I didn't end the vlog well. I didn't like end the clip yesterday because I was just so tired. I got to work at 9 and I work like a 12 hour shift. So, but it's like 9 o'clock now and I'm going in to help my old store. So, I'm about to take a shower, brush my teeth, and get ready. <laughs> La Roche Posay, I use the Gentle Foaming Moisturizer Wash. It's for dry to extra dry skin for body and face. I have eczema and psoriasis, so this is heaven sent. <laughs> obviously but i'm about to run to mcdonald's to get something to drink um get a coffee and probably something like to snack on really quick um it's so bad i need to stop eating now like it, it really is it's getting bad but i think um i'm gonna do a video of like <laughs> me like forcing myself to eat what's at home like and stop buying out but anyways <clears throat> I'm going to work for as long as I want to today so I'm probably going to get off before like the sun goes down because I need to run to the mall I really don't feel like doing that today but it looks like it's probably going to be the best day to do it so I'm probably going to get off around a good time so I can go up to the mall and then I wanted to wash my hair today I'm still debating about that because you know natural hair natural hair is just so it's a job in itself and so I might dragging it out, but we'll see. Cause I actually don't have any more like shampoo conditioner that I actually like using. So, and I need like curl creams, leave-in, like I, all that stuff is like gone. Or like it's like this much left. So I don't know. I may just rock this out to the weekend. But I just I'll y'all show y'all before I get out how I did my hair. It's just a zigzag part, slick back with a clip. It's cute and simple. Well, let's go to uh, McDonald's. I promise you guys, I'll show you my hair. See, it's just a zigzag. Zigzag part with some uh, edges out. And then a claw clip. Girl, keep it simple. Keep it cute. Um, I just got some fries from McDonald's because I missed the breakfast. So, I mean, I just got me a medium fry. And I got me a coffee. She looked real good. Mm -hmm. But let's go in and get this truck done because, girl, I be putting up them drugs so fast. She don't play. She gets down. She get down. She do not play. Okay. Let's go. Good afternoon. I'm back in the car. Um, I actually just got off. Because I was like, I pretty much did everything I needed to do to help out there. So I was like, there's no point in me just staying here. I'm ready to go. Because I got things that I got to handle. I got to run up to um, the credit union that I'm, play I'm paying my car loan through. And give them the proof of my new insurance. Because I forgot to do that. And they need that while I'm paying my stuff off. So I'm gonna do that. And then I'm also gonna run up to the mall. I just don't get it. Like, <laughs> how are we all outside at the same time? Y'all don't got no job. Y'all don't got no job. Let me know what y'all do. 
as long as it's legal because i can't go to jail I, I can't that's one thing i'm not doing is going to jail like y'all be thinking that's hard and it's really not like ain't nothing cute about going to jail hurry up I got back in the car. I just went to the um, beauty supply store. It's really crazy how much they be making like us black folks pay for stuff for our hair. Like it makes no sense. Like how white people, and I'm not trying to come for nobody, but it, I just find it really crazy how like products that are for the white culture for their their type of hair, ten dollars at most, maybe twenty, like maybe twenty if you're getting something that's top of the line. Well, you know what I'm saying, like. A really good product for us to get something decent it's like $15 a piece each like each thing shampoo is $15 conditioner is 15 leave-ins 15 curl butter is 15 like that's just ridiculous like why did I get four things and it's $60 that makes no sense but I got the miel mango and Tulsi line um, I got the conditioner because I don't have anything to wash my hair with or do my natural hair. So that's the only reason why I had to spend this money was because I really need to wash my hair. But I'm not going to leave it like untouched, like not cared for. So I got the conditioner. It smells pretty good. I'm not going to lie. It smells really good. And then I got leave-in conditioner but on the same line. It smells really good too. You know, it was fifteen dollars, and then I got the shampoo. Oops. Nah, girl, we can't waste none of that. Uh, uh, I paid too much money. That smells really good. I really like that. And then I got, I bought the argan oil from Cream Cream of Nature. I just got the mousse because sometimes just freshening up my hair in the morning, I just use mousse just to revive those curls again. And it was only six ninety nine. Like I'm gonna buy this one over the one. Whoops. This car, cause you're taking picture of like, like scratches or something. But mousse in this line, the Mio line, is $15.99. Oh, $6.99. It does the same thing. What's the difference? Anyways, I would have went to like Dollar General or Target to get some hair stuff, but Dollar General really don't be having much. And then Target, they they have some good things, but like they're just really expensive. And I'm just like, like, can I go just breathe? Can I just breathe? But I'm gonna go to the mall. Um, I'm gonna go to the mall so I can do some Christmas shopping. Um, Cause Christmas is literally Monday, and everybody's getting the stuff at the store. I gotta buy for Justin, and then my person that I got for Sweet Santa. We did at my house where everybody's just like buying for their person just so that we can make it more cost effective um for everybody else just because like this year has been really hard on everybody and like inflation is just crazy so we just decided to do secret santa of course me and justin are in a relationship and we like to buy for each other have like our own little christmas celebration as well so i'm gonna do that and see what i can find at the mall and then if whatever i need to do i'll probably just order it i know it's kind of hard to like order something now but they have options where you can order it and pick it up in store. So maybe that will help along. But I think everything that I need really I can find in the mall. Um, or like surrounding stores around the mall. So let's go ahead and do that. Alright guys, I'm back in the car from the mall. Um, I just got a few things. Actually one thing. And then I got me Chick-fil-A because what I needed, they are out of one of the materials until Thursday. So I'm going to go back on Thursday to get done what I needed for a Christmas present. It's 5.24 or about that time. Let me see. It's, it's 5.20. Mine is ahead on my car, but my watch says 5.20. And so, I have to pee so bad. I have to pee. I have to pee so bad. Uh, so, so, so bad. And I just I'm tired.
is it with no product in it? I normally put my hair in sections and um, do like my whole routine, but I'm really feeling lazy right now. So I think I'm just gonna like do it in bigger sections. <laughs> just in time for me to go ahead and put the clothes in the dryer and like fold the other two loads that's been just chilling in my room for the past few days like before I even left to Orlando so I'm gonna go ahead and take care of that because I'm just tired of seeing the laundry everywhere so let's go so this is what we're working with <laughs> on top of all this so I'm going to end the video here. Um, I know you guys saw that I said I'm going to go ahead and fold the clothes. I'm going to do that. I'm really tired and I have a almost a 12 hour shift tomorrow. So I just want to relax for the like, rest of the night and just prepare myself for tomorrow. So I'm going to end it here. Thank you guys for following me throughout my day. Um, this is realistic. I don't do much, uh, even though in my mind it feels like I do a lot of running around. But um, I hope you guys enjoyed and I'm, thank you guys for watching me document my life and I'll see you guys in the next video.